In this video we're going to review folding saws for tree cutting. This is AgX Presents Garden Product Reviews and I'm Damon, your host. I've been gardening most of my life, 30 something years and uh, I'm older than that obviously but um, yeah these are what I've found that are most beneficial. Is uh, This one is a Japanese blade uh, saw and it dulled fairly quickly, it uh, warped fairly quickly, and I um, actually don't recommend this particular uh, brand. Uh, this is like a 6 inch, it says made in Japan, which the Japanese steel is usually very good. Um, uh, for some reason this is just a knockoff of a Felco saw that's just not as good. Definitely recommend the Felco saw. This is the GR17 ARS. Uh, it says ARS on there, so you can see what that is. Um, I don't exactly recommend that. I would certainly spend a few more bucks and get the Felco saw, the 6 inch. Um, just amazing saw, lasts a long time, stays super sharp, the dual cutting action. Um, uh, but then I wanted a, a larger saw. I have this one in a shopping bag because it bites. You can see the distance in between the teeth and the jaw, we'll call it. Um, I've really cut myself bad on that. Uh, I had it in my backpack and went to, I don't know, in there for something else, I think, and just got stuck in there. And man, I was bleeding for a long time, days. Um, it just wouldn't close because uh, it was just an awkward, those are some gnarly teeth, uh, which are great for cutting trees. Uh, so recommend it for that. This is the Corona 10 inch folding saw. Uh, very good that way. They do not make a scabbard or sheath for uh, putting this in. Um, but man, this really goes through some, some serious uh, tree sizing. Like you can get, you can, I can, I've done, what do you call this? Maybe a six inch thick uh, tree I've gotten through without, without too much difficulty. Um, just took some time, but um, this this is I've used this a lot, and it's still very sharp. Uh, razor, razor tooth saw, Corona. Um, what else does that say? Pullback cutting action. Uh, something 265. Um, it wore off there from use, but um, but yeah, this is a great tool. Just be crazy careful uh, with the. I don't know why it it is nice that ergonomic curved part when you're when you're using it push the button, open it up, it clicks locked, um, and then that is a good grip that uh, you can really, uh, you can get some height also up into trees, but um, it, it's nice ergonomically when you're using it, but when it's when it's folded, that is a dangerous, uh, what do you call that, liaison, a dangerous proposition, I suppose. Um, therefore, I, uh, I just keep it in a shopping bag. I just put that and I, and I like cut myself so good on it that I actually put it in two shopping bags just for an added layer of don't bite me again please. Um, I haven't had a problem since I've been putting it in the bag so so there's the Corona 10 inch folding saw um, and the ARS uh, which I do not recommend. Um, I, and for either size, really, I do recommend the Felco saws. They are just uh, really well made, Swiss precision, and uh, we're going to get into the, the other Felco tools in the next video. Um, we have some kind of unique ones. Uh, this is ones I've had since I was 16, so uh, stay tuned for that. AgX presents Garden Product Reviews.